So I'm under the uh, uh, bathroom, and this is what was uh, leaking before. So these are all, uh, looks like this got it all fixed up. A lot of goop on it. And the uh, support it with a steel band. They still use plastic on that. Now, if you want to stick your head in here, uh, this is where it was leaking before. Uh -huh. This band here, they're supposed to use a uh, uh, plastic band, not a, not a steel band. And here's this, uh, here's this brick over here. From over here, you can see this. So, uh, see the brick here? They uh, use the brick to support it. Oh, it's still there? Yep, still there. The brick can stay up. And over here they got uh, metal against the uh, copper pipe, so uh, it's no good. Uh, you may want to try to use a more qualified. Fines. I'm walking over or crawling over to okay the uh, pipe from the uh, the second bay in it's not sloped properly that wasn't fixed so it, that needs to be supported so uh, there you go <sighs> The leak, famous leak over here, has been repaired. This is the rear, uh, rear uh, uh, the rear uh, crawl space under the newer master bathroom. When I was here before, it was leaking like a sieve. So looks like this is all taken care of now. Gonna do the tub. Oh. Have, uh, this is the rear foundation. There are some bolting on it. And then uh, this is the four inch drain under the toilet. And you have uh, a two inch or inch and a half uh, drain coming down from the tub. And it's supported by uh, still uh, tape. And we use plastic today. And uh, so that's what you have here. Over here, you have some uh, steel uh, on top of the copper, and that'll corrode over time. So we're in the uh, house at the Remington, and uh, they put a new water heater in. It has a loose uh, strap on top, and it's right against the wood uh, trim, and it's a single wall vent pipe and the uh, water heater uh, installation manual requires a type 2, type B uh, dual wall metal pipe and uh, so you can see it's a newer water heater. A couple of other things here. The uh, serial number is uh, K, so that would be 2013. Bradford and White's a good brand. The vent here 
there should be three screws here. These uh, connectors here should uh, be uh, insulated. Uh, when you're in a cabinet, the, uh, vent, the TPR is supposed to go uh, uh, drain to that side of the cabinet, but uh, this is least of your problems. Uh, the gas uh, connector should be replaced every time you replace a water heater. And it's missing a sediment trap. There's no sediment trap here. The uh, installation manual was removed. Uh, so that you have uh, another incomplete job from probably the same plumber. And uh, again, this is on Remington. It's Tuesday, September uh, 10th today. This is Greg Noyes of Pacific West Home Inspections, and I'm doing a uh, uh, re-inspection. And I can be reached at 818-362-5578. Thanks.